Ariel Hawani post fight at UFC 146, and you'll never guess who he just bumped into. Yes, Cain Velasquez, a bloodied Cain Velasquez. Are you a fan of blood? Do you like being covered and showered in blood? It doesn't bother me, you know. My wife, uh, I know, I know she was cringing at that at that scene, you know, towards the end. But um, it doesn't bother me at all, you know. The the smell, it was just a lot, lot you know, a lot slipperier. Um, just kind of be aware of that. What do you do in a situation like that? Because as you said, it's very slippery. You're still trying, and you could tell he's very bothered by it. He kept shaking his head. So how do you sort of attack? You know, with that, with that, I, I um, it's just in a really bad spot. It's right in his eyes. I mean, at that moment, I mean, it, it you know, he, he really had no chance. I mean, it's it's kind of hard to kind of come back from that when your vision is just it's just going um, out the window. So, um, you know, it was just a lot. It was just really in my favor. Did you try to cut him? No, no. You know, I was trying to get a uh, good ground and pound from my, with my punches. Uh, I felt like I couldn't get enough distance between me and him, so I just put my hand to get, create that distance, and then just, just shot an elbow down, and it you know, just happened in the right spot. You mentioned Daniel Cormier, and he picked up the win over him. What exactly did he tell you? And you said it in the cage as well. What exactly did he tell you about how to beat him? Because that takedown to start off the fight was just, it, it was a beautiful thing to watch. We just know we just known a lot that, um, that Silva does a lot of kicks to the, to the midsection of his opponents right away. And you know, Daniel just said, if he does that, catch it and, and run him down. You know, Daniel did the same thing. He caught it. He caught his kick. You know, um, so I mean, I, I was looking for that. That was one thing I was looking, uh, that I was looking for. Um, also, constantly moving to the right, fast punches in and out. And um, you know, um, the takedowns there, take it. But I mean, de definitely never rush anything. Would you describe the feeling that you're feeling right now as as relief, uh, joy? I mean, just coming off what happened in November. How would you describe your emotions? Um, just, just a step in the right direction, you know. It's obviously not where, where I want to be. You know, I want to have that belt around, around my waist. So um, I won't be happy until I get it. Did that sort of make things better for you? Like, did you get this new sort of killer instinct now? Are you a better fighter than the guy who fought Dos Santos as a result of that? As far as this night be, and, and that night, yeah, I am, you know. Um, just the things going on uh, with me before that fight and this fight, I just feel a lot better right now. You know, I'm, um, I'm happy, I'm, I'm, I'm healthy, so... I mean, just different turnout. You got next? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. You know, they haven't fought yet, so uh, I'll, I'll, I would love to rematch, but uh, we'll just gotta see what happens. Thank you, Kane, and congrats. Thank you.